Hey guys, it's Mini Kit Monday and I wanted to show you this fun kit idea. It's using a box frame, an A-size transfer, a paste packet single, and a mini squeegee, and then this is a palette to put your paste in. I'm going to first open up my transfer, which by the way, did you know on the back of the transfer it includes how-to instructions. You can just look at those if you forget any simple steps, but you start by first fuzzing your transfer. This is to make it so it's not too sticky. You get a little bit of lint on the back side. So it peels off easily from your surface and doesn't stretch the transfer when you peel it up. Go ahead and place it down and center it as best as you can. Then grab your paste, go ahead and put it inside of your palette or you can put it directly onto your surface with the transfer if you don't have a palette. And then go ahead and apply it generously to your design. I like to put on more than what you need. That way I can cover the entire design without the chalk paste drying it out since it is air hungry. It does dry within a few minutes. So I like to just put it on really well and then I just go ahead and remove all of the extra um, before peeling up my transfer and then you're good to peel it up. And look how cute! <laughs> Ready, aim, fire! Um, I'm also going to show you real quick how I clean my transfer. You can clean it in a sink. Right here is just a, a metal tin of water and I'm going to just save my extra paste, wash my palette, wash, wash my squeegee. Your squeegee is something that you'll just have for the life of your projects. It's not, not something that ever like wears out. Um, same thing with your little palette surfaces, although they are really cheap if you'd rather just throw them away. I like to save mine though. And then I'm going ahead and using our board eraser to remove the chalk paste off of the transfer. Um, it's just a quick and easy way to clean it. And then I let it just dry sticky side up. Something that I like to do to make it dry a little faster is to just quickly wipe it down with either a towel or a paper towel. Um, and that just makes it so it dries really quick. And my sign's ready to go. Put my transfer back on its backer. And then you can save it back in the wrapping that you had it with originally. Or get a little cute portfolio book to keep your transfers in. Whatever works for you. But boom. Look how cute.